Have you ever paused to consider the profound impact of giving in the Christian faith? In the heart of Christianity, giving holds a pivotal role, a practice that weaves into the very fabric of our spiritual lives. Let's cast our minds to the wisdom within the Holy Scriptures. In the second letter to the Corinthians, chapter 9, verse 7, we find a beautiful reminder of the joy in giving. The passage reads, Each of you should give what you have decided in your heart to give, not reluctantly or under compulsion, for God loves a cheerful giver. In the book of Acts, chapter 20, verse 35, we are taught the blessings of generosity through the words of our Lord Jesus himself. He said, it is more blessed to give than to receive. So as we can see, giving is not just a part of our faith, but a crucial practice that shapes our spiritual journey and community. But what exactly do we gain from giving, you might wonder? Well, let me tell you, the rewards are plentiful and profound. When we give, we experience a deep sense of inner joy. It's a feeling that can't be replicated by any material possession. It's the joy of knowing that we are making a difference, that we are helping someone in need. Moreover, giving fosters spiritual growth. As we give, we become more like Christ, who gave selflessly for us all. It's a way of cultivating a generous spirit, a heart that mirrors the heart of God. And let's not forget the strengthening of our church community. When we give, we are participating in a collective effort, a united endeavor to spread God's love. In the wisdom of Proverbs 11:24, 25, one person gives freely yet gains even more, another withholds unduly but comes to poverty. A generous person will prosper, whoever refreshes others will be refreshed. Indeed, giving enriches us, it nourishes our spirit and it fortifies our church community. So, what does this mean for us as members of the Exalted Word Ministries? Well, it's a call to action, a call to a more generous life. This isn't just about fulfilling a duty or ticking off a box. No, it's about embracing a spirit of generosity that enriches our lives and strengthens the bonds of our community. We're reminded of a passage in the first letter to Timothy chapter 6, verse 18. Command them to do good, to be rich in good deeds, and to be generous and willing to share. This isn't just a directive, it's an invitation, an opportunity to deepen our faith through the act of giving. Let's remember, generosity isn't just about money, it's about time, talents, and heart. It's about being there for each other, about lifting each other up. As we give, we grow, we bless, and we build. That is the transformative power of giving in our Christian faith.